Welcome back, curious minds. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of economics and exploring the concept of elasticity of demand. Join us on this enlightening journey as we unravel the relationship between price sensitivity and consumer behavior. Elasticity of demand measures how responsive consumers are to changes in price. It helps us understand how much quantity demanded changes when prices fluctuate. So, let's delve into the different types of demand elasticity. When demand is elastic, it means that consumers are highly responsive to changes in price. A small change in price leads to a proportionally larger change in quantity demanded. This usually occurs when there are readily available substitutes for the product or when the purchase represents a significant portion of the consumer's budget. On the other hand, demand is considered inelastic when consumers are less responsive to price changes. Even significant price fluctuations result in relatively small changes in quantity demanded. Inelastic demand often occurs when there are limited substitutes or when the product is a necessity. Another aspect of demand elasticity is cross-price elasticity. This measures the responsiveness of demand for one product to changes in the price of another related product. Positive cross-price elasticity indicates that two products are substitutes, where an increase in the price of one leads to an increase in demand for the other. Negative cross-price elasticity suggests that the products are complements, meaning an increase in the price of one leads to a decrease in demand for the other. Several factors influence demand elasticity. Firstly, the availability of substitutes plays a crucial role. The more substitutes there are for a product, the more elastic the demand tends to be. Consumers can easily switch to alternatives if the price of a particular product increases. Income elasticity is another factor to consider. It measures the responsiveness of demand to changes in consumers' income. Products can be classified as normal goods, where demand increases with income, or inferior goods, where demand decreases as income rises. Understanding demand elasticity is vital for businesses and policymakers. It helps determine pricing strategies, predict the impact of price changes on revenue, and assess the overall market dynamics. Elasticity of demand provides insights into consumer behavior and helps in making informed decisions. It's important to note that demand elasticity can vary across different products and industries. Identifying the elasticity of demand for a specific product allows businesses to adapt their pricing and marketing strategies accordingly. Thanks for joining us today. If you found this video informative, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more engaging content. Let us know in the comments if you have any questions about demand elasticity or if you'd like us to explore any other economic concepts. Until next time, keep exploring the fascinating world of economics. Thanks for watching.